What up boys and welcome back to another TBC Classic video. So today is Monday and every single Monday I always do like a mailbox clean out. It doesn't matter if it's retail or Classic Realms. Uh, whatever I'm playing I'm always doing like this Monday uh, clean out. So right now obviously I'm super focused on TBC Classic. So we're going to take a look at the mailbox and see what I farmed and how much gold I've made. So before we dive into this uh, beautiful mailbox... I do want to mention that you guys can still obtain the complete gold guide for Classic TBC. And if you use the code TBC, you will get it for 50% off. So it's a guide that contains all the best farms in uh, TBC. And you can find a link to it down below in the uh, description, but also pinned comments. So I'm not playing as much as I want to be playing right now. And it's going to definitely show in the sales that I have. Uh, but like uh, I sold roughly 200 uh, auctions and the first 100 auctions is 2,500 gold clean out. So a bunch of Primal Life together with Terracon because obviously I did just did uh, yesterday upload a video on 5 hours of Terracon farming. So there's going to be a lot of those sales like more Terracon down here, some Basilisks uh, just from keeping like when you have to kill Basilisks and so on. When you do Herbalism also from leveling up and also from testing stuff. So, uh, more herbs, Dream and Glory right here. Uh, got this uh, blue item that dropped. Only 15 gold for that one, though. Nothing really, uh, like, just it's just a bunch of Terracone. The price on him dropped this weekend, though, which uh, was bad timing since that was when I finished the video and I was finally about to sell it. Uh, Primal Life, Monotissel, Fellow, this Primal Life. It's basically just herbalism uh, right here. There's nothing, nothing of interest besides from that. So I'm uh, soon going to change out Herbalism for a new profession. I haven't decided exactly which one I'm going to go for uh, to begin with. So uh, there's not going to be any more herbs in the mailbox soonish. Soonish. I still got a couple of things left to do with Herbalism though. So I'm going to go ahead and reload the mailbox. And hopefully there's going to be a decent amount of gold in the uh, remaining 95 auctions as well. There's 2,000 golds, that's good. Uh, let's see, Fellow Armaments, Primal Air, did some Primal Air farming, Primal Mana, did a bunch of Primal Mana farming. Uh, yeah, more Primal Mana. You got the Prison Keys that I also did recently. So those sold, that's nice, like 14 gold each. It sold off some enchanting mats that I had laying around from uh, leveling in dungeons. Crafted a shit ton of bags, uh, horrible price, but uh, like, what is it, 5 gold each, 494, yeah. But I got a bunch of cloth from doing my 5 hours of prison key farming, and I just made all of that into bags. Then selling some uh, healing pots and mana pots also from the prison key farm. So overall we made like uh, 4.5k gold this week, which is not bad, because I spent like my entire Saturday doing, uh, doing Karasan. And I only played Monday, Wednesday, Friday for like three and a half hours uh, each day. Well, on those days. So I haven't spent that much time. But now we're at almost 34,000 gold in Classic. Still don't know what I'm going to spend my gold on. Everyone is calling me cheap because I'm still uh, walking around with the Traveler's backpack. Even though I have over 30,000 gold. And there's still a lot of pieces uh, like BOE pieces and BOP uh, tailoring uh, pieces that I can craft. Like the Shadow Cloth Seth, like Spell Strike Hood, Spell Strike Pants. There's a bunch of stuff that I can buy. But I actually enjoy doing like semi casual raiding. So hopefully I'm going to get some items that way. Uh, but that was also it for today's video. Got a bunch of new farms coming out for you guys. So make sure you are subscribed to the channel and you will be notified whenever I upload a new video. But that's pretty much it. See you guys in tomorrow's video. Until then, bye bye.